I've been working on um, disease suppression, which is the ability of the microbial population in the soil to actually inhibit fungal root diseases. We achieved disease suppression at Minipa Ag Centre in a paddock called North 12. The concept of disease suppression was first identified by Dave Roger at Avon in a long-term rotation trial. In uh, continuous cereal crops with higher nutrition, they actually, the microbial population in the soil increased to a stage where the, it could inhibit the funguses, especially Rhizoctonia and Tacle. At Streaky Bay, a rotation trial to see if we could achieve the same effect on a grey calcareous soil. The trial was established in 2004 and we had different nutrition treatments. Um, a higher nutrition treatment with fluid fertiliser compared to district practice which was granular fertiliser. And we also had different rotations. So we had the district practice which was a cereal and medic based rotation and we had a continuous cereal system and then we had a brassica break system with canola. And what we found was after three wet seasons in 2009, 10 and 11 that we hadn't achieved disease suppression. There was some Rosoctonia present but it was mainly takeall which took out the crops. So the results from this research was that disease suppression was not achieved on the grey calcareous soils after eight years of the rotation trial. The fluid fertiliser systems resulted in higher yields in the district practice and this was especially evident in good seasons. And the other major outcome was that having canola within the rotation can lower Rhizoctonia inoculum levels for one season.